Hello everyone, uh, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I am going to take you through one of the most beautiful libraries in Singapore. And this library has opened up recently. It's a pretty new library and it is our first visit today. And so I thought why not start my vlog with the visit to the library. And uh, fortunately this library is pretty close to our uh, residence. So we are going to cycle. It's going to be 15 minute cycle ride. So without wasting much time, let's get started. Get on to our cycle and I'm going to take you through the library today. Let's go. Let's get started. Uh, so this is my cycle. My daughter and my husband are also accompanying me because she's the one who reads the most. And uh, I'm moving towards the lift of our floor. We live on 16th floor. So let's get going. We're moving down the lift and it takes a while because we are on 16th floor. There we go. Out of the lift. I'm holding the camera with one hand and in one hand the cycle to record before I actually start cycling. So this is the exit. Okay, that's my daughter and my husband. Let's get moving now. That's a block. Okay. Okay, my daughter is trying my husband's cycle. Gosh. So here we are onto the road cycling. Uh, please excuse the difference in the sound because I did this as voiceover since I was cycling. I did not uh, want it to speak and cycle together for safety uh, purposes. Coming back to the vlog, uh, you would notice on the left there is a school though it is not very prominent in the video but it, there is a public school on our left hand side which is very close to our block like 5 minutes walking distance and uh, we are taking the cycling uh, path to cycle towards the community centre where the library is situated. We usually uh, prefer taking roads which are not very busy since we have a young one cycling along with us. Uh, though she is used to cycling long distances but it's always uh, preferable to take less busy roads. Here we arrived at the community centre. So um, if you ever get to visit Singapore you would notice uh, that the most of the public libraries are either in the uh, shopping malls or they are in the community centres to make it convenient for the patrons to access the library and it becomes much easier even when you want to come back uh, to the library to return the books because usually the library is on your way or you are visiting the shopping mall to shop and we happen to visit the community center over the weekend so usually the, over the weekends the community center is bustling with some of the other event going on at the community center foyer or you know uh, some of the other venues within the community center so the day we went there one uh, event was happening being which was being conducted by the Malay community in Singapore so we did stop by to have a look uh, as of what they were performing it was uh, quite interesting but uh, my daughter was more keen to visit the library so without wasting much time we took the escalator up to the level 2 so the day we visited the library only I think two doors were uh, open that day to access uh, because library was still under uh, what do I say not construction construction but that, yes they were putting the entire library together and the formal launch was not done so by this time only the soft launch of the library was done and only two floors were open so we chose to walk up and take the level 2 because uh, I think on the level 2 uh, yes so on the level 2 was the uh, children's section which we wanted to access and uh, most of the fiction and non-fiction books for children were being uh, put up on the level 2. So you can see it was quite a busy day uh, with so many people around but library is very prominent uh, if you happen to visit there and uh, yes so uh, you know it, 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 it was very inviting at the entrance and uh, it looked quite uh, you know sparkly. Uh, being the new library it was very open and very inviting for all the children it has uh, multiple sections in the library 
and uh, not only for children but uh, it is a very inviting space for adults whether you read or you do not read uh, it's always uh, nice to visit the library you know at least it makes you it motivates you to pick up a book and read so these were the few sections which we explored that day my daughter went uh, really uh, bonkers looking around to see you know what all the library had to offer even i was very keen to know so let's get together and explore this wonderful library and i don't think i really need to speak or share anything i would let you watch the video and uh, see for yourself that how wonderful and beautiful <laughs> this library was and uh, this was one of the experiences from our first visit and uh, we will be visiting this library more often not we can't read so many
All right. So I hope you all enjoyed uh, our today's vlog of the visit to the library. This library is actually located in one of the community centers. So you can see there is hawker center right behind me, and a lot of other things are also going on because it's evening and it's Saturday. So stay tuned for uh, more videos. I shall see you soon again. Bye bye. Bye.